No way. My doll is pregnant. Breathe deeply. Don't panic. The birth will be delivered by professionals. We'll help Barbie give birth to a healthy baby. What disrespect! Hoopila! I'm taking this! Um, nom, 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 nom. Get her out of here! Is she gone? Hey! Sorry, I was scared. Look, wow. Opila Bird oh. left her egg here. Maybe she forgot hmm. it? Hmm. Why do you think Opila got offended? Oh, it's moving. The egg is about to hatch. That means we have to get ready. Let's give him a little help. There's a big omelet waiting for us. Here comes breakfast. No! <laughs> Mia, we can't eat Barbie. And if you pepper it. Um, yeah, you're right. She shouldn't be in a frying pan. Dirty doll needs a beauty treatment. <laughs> Direct it, that's cool. <laughs> what do I need it for? Oops, did it accidentally. Let's get started, shall we? It's time to give her old shine back. There won't be a drop of slime left on her face after these intense treatments. And the sponge will get rid of toothpaste. At least now Barbie can be recognized. She's pretty again. But something's missing, don't you think? She definitely needs a makeover. Let's start by dyeing her hair pink. Great idea. That would definitely be her style. Blondie, it's time for you to upgrade your hair. Trust us. We apply a lot of bright pink hair dye, which is our starlet's favorite color after all. Then we use a brush to distribute the dye evenly through the locks. Halfway done. What's next? All that's left is to dry them. Mm, leave that to me. She looks so good in pink. But we have to trim the ends. <laughs> hey, you can't do that. It's a doll, not a bush in the yard. But I wanted to save time. Mm. Uh, you convinced me. Will the doll scissors do? Honey, don't worry. The fate of your hair is in the hands of professionals. Not bad. But maybe make it even shorter? The trendy hair is done. It looks modern and original. And with this hairstyle, admiring glances are guaranteed. Oh, look what a handsome guy! I can! Ew, what an ugly doll. Don't they teach him manners? He has no taste at all. Don't listen to him. Let's dress you up. Those blouses went out of fashion a long time ago. Be a part of this too. What cute scissors. If we have to change the image, we'll do it drastically. Let's pick out some better clothes for her. And they cut surprisingly well. Hold her. The old fashioned outfit is going to be recycled. Yoo hoo! Three pointer! Gotcha! Would you like to see the result of your makeover? Ah! You can see those bags under the eyes right from space! Doll should definitely have some spa treatments and relaxation. I think you would like a relaxing head massage. It will make your skin soft and shiny. And the patches will help get rid of the bags under your eyes. Oh, it's been a long time since I've been in a jacuzzi. Phew, I'm a little tired. Well, Barbie, get out. We'll help you dry off. I hope after all that stress you were able to relax. She looks satisfied. It's time to make her outfit. We take the balloon and cut off a small piece, from which we'll make the doll's clothes. Clever idea. The top was easy to put on. We'll have a set, and we're going to cut out a skirt for that. It fits just perfect. But that's not all. Barbie's image lacks detail. Um, this garbage will only ruin the look piece off the rest of the balloon. Mia, you're a born designer. But our fashionista doesn't have to go barefoot, does she? To make shoes, we use orange colored balloons. We leave the tails and put an insole inside. And then from felt paper, we cut out an outsole for them, which we then neatly glue to the shoes. They are beautiful and comfortable. You can wear them even every season. Here are your shoes, Cinderella. Any doll would envy such a stylish look. Oh, you did a good job. <gasps> oh, Barbie, honey, did you eat something bad? It seems that the problem is not food poisoning. Mia, I think I know what happened. 
Well, what? Our doll is having a baby! <laughs> oh, what a twist! I didn't see that coming! Want some candy? No, I'll pass. Weirdo. Then I'll get more. Okay, we need to focus on the mommy-to-be. Let's start with the ultrasound. We'll soon find out who lives in your tummy. And that's… Opila Bird. What a cutie! Congratulations! <laughs> Time to make a belly for Barbie. This shouldn't be too hard. We take a toy egg and cut holes for the legs and body like I did. Such a belly is easy to put on a doll. And it suits Barbie. Ow, I'm in labor! Lie down on the couch, we'll take care of you. Ah, ah, phew, phew, can't we just fast forward? Making the incision, I can see the egg. It's so tiny and cute. You rest, mommy, while we take care of the newborn. Any baby needs a diaper. So the first thing we do is put it on. Here you go. You probably want to spend time with the baby. Oh, an adorable sight. Oh, but too bright. Wow, it must be heavy for mommy to hold it. Kids grow up so fast. Tweet, tweet! Welcome to this world, baby bird. Barbie, congratulations, you have a healthy Opila. Wow, hooray! She's a bird, she needs a nest. But what would it be made of? What about, where is it? The rubber ducks. Opila, look at your rubber congener. They won't get along. Everything is wrong for her. Hmm, what else have I got there? Now that looks more convincing. The threads will do. I know the right way to use them. Will you blow us a balloon? Let her participate in the process too. Great! Let's put the balloon in the bowl. And pour lots and lots of glitter glue on top, just to be sure. Do you think that'll be enough? Something tells me it will. Before the glue dries, let's start wrapping the balloon with threads. Are we sure we have enough of it? Phew, I'm done. Oh, so the glue's dried. Time to pop the balloon? Yes, go ahead. Let's see the results. We are so creative, and it came out great. Oh, Pila, do you like it here? Now she has her own oh. private nest. <laughs> oh, my poor ears. Uh, apparently she's hungry. We'll have to make the worms ourselves. Why don't we make them out of fruit juice? An orange has lots of vitamins, just right for the baby. I agree. An apple would work for that, too. So what did the young babysitters have in mind? Our recipe will require gelatin. We add it to the juice and stir it vigorously. And here are the molds for the future worms. I can't wait to see what we get out of this. We put the straws together with a rubber band and then pour the already ready mixture inside. And when the process is done, we have to wait for the mixture to freeze. Well, time to see what goodies we got. Down with the tubes. Wow, yummy fruit worms. Oh, Pila, your dinner is ready. Open your beak. Isn't that what you wanted? Since she's not screaming, she likes everything. A young puppet mom has work to do, too. Good luck! In the meantime, we'll build a kindergarten for Opila. Real magic! Let's make it even cooler than in the game. Let's start with the paint job first. The garden of Bam Bam needs to be colorful. So sky-colored paint would be the perfect choice. I just bought a new paint roller, and we'll use it to transform the place. And where would you go without the famous monsters from the game? Jumbo Josh, Bam Bam, Opila Bird, Captain Fiddles, Bambolina. Oh, I think I forgot someone. Name all the heroes from Garden of Bam Bam you know. In the meantime, we'll spread out the rolls of lawn grass to make our little bird feel like she's in nature. A table and chairs are just necessary for fun gatherings with friends. And if suddenly you get bored, you can always play with them in the sandbox. And here's our perky company who also came to kindergarten. Now Opila Bird will definitely not feel lonely while her mom is at work. It turned out even better than I imagined. You and I did great. But I have to go home. Hey, leave the doll here. But I want to play with it too. We didn't agree to that. Ah, Barbie! I hope she's all right. 
Yeah, that ingredient in the soup is extra. Finally, I'll read in silence. Where'd that doll come from? Ugh, oh, disgusting. There's Charmander, catch him. Ah! Since when can Barbie fly? It's like she survived the slime apocalypse. Do you know what happened to this doll? Write in the comments. We should get her cleaned up. Let's get rid of the dirt with toothpaste. That will definitely help. We'll have to do a lot of work. Leave it to me. I got the toughest brush on purpose. I'll give it a professional facial cleaning. There won't be a speck left. Well, shall we see the results? You didn't just wipe off a spot, you wiped off her whole face. Oops, overdid it. It's lucky that I can rewind time a few minutes back and fix the situation. You should do it more carefully. Yeah, you're probably right. I'll do it gently so I don't damage it. Now that's a whole other thing. Her skin is just shiny. Ugh, but her hair is all slimy. Ugh. The only thing that helps is a shaving machine. What's that buzzing noise? Ah, my beautiful Lux! I can't. It hurts me to look at it. That's the only way we'll get rid of the slime completely. There's one last strand left. Now we can choose her new hairstyle and upgrade her image. So where do we start? How about a headdress? That hat looks nice, what do you think? Let's have another look. Hmm, pretty classy. But it's not her style. Barbie needs something different. Interesting, but it's not it. Oh, I love it. Me too, it's decided. Yeah. Those Pikachu ears are so cute. Our Barbie is unique, but her clothes don't match her hair. We need to update the doll's look. Down with the boring blouse and jeans. This has been out of fashion for a long time. That's right. We'll find her an outfit a hundred times better. We won't need these old rags anymore. I just found a doll's trash can. We, as your personal stylists, will make you irresistible. Or are you tired and would rather take a lunch break? What do you want to eat? Mmm, looks delicious. Oh, I feel sick. Oh no, what's wrong with her? Maybe she ate a stale avocado toast? Wait, what is that? Let's take a closer look. Pretty girl <gasps> is going to have a baby. Now that's news. I'm so happy. Even a doll needs an abdominal ultrasound if she's pregnant. And there are doll hospitals for that. First, we'll apply a special gel. Let's see if Barbie is having a boy or a girl. And that's Pikachu? Pika, Pika. Wow, I didn't see that coming. Blondie's pregnant with a Pokemon. I almost forgot. I have to wipe off the gel. And there are even mini wipes for that. After all, Barbie has another treatment waiting for her. We're going to make her a pregnant belly. First, we take plasticine and knead it. And then we put a Pikachu toy in the middle. We mold everything on the doll's belly and wrap a piece of food wrap around her waist so that there are no wrinkles. At the back, we fix everything to hold it in place. Now take the white plasticine, knead it again, and mold it over the belly. We fix the irregularities and remove extra pieces so that the shape is perfect. And at the end, draw a belly button. Take time for the plasticine to dry. When it passes, carefully remove everything. Take out Pikachu and put it inside the white plasticine. The main thing is not to damage the shape. And now we are going to make a belly belt out of Velcro. But how to attach them properly? For this, we use a hot melt adhesive. It always helps me out. We put it on the edge of the Velcro or on the stomach from the inside. It is important to glue the Velcro evenly. The belt is ready. Next, we'll make an umbilical cord for Pikachu. We'll take a regular rubber band and glue one end to the plasticine belly and the other to the doll baby. Now we can attach everything in its place. Awesome, it turned out really cute. It's not over yet. There's one final touch left. We're going to paint the belly so it looks like a Pokeball. To do this, we'll paint the top half with red paint. 
and with black paint, a neat line in the middle. Adding a white circle at the end. Voila! A real Pokemon mom. By the way, I got clothes ready for her. Now the young mommy will be the most stylish. You did a good job. It looks great on her. I think she likes it too. Uh-oh. The baby's impatient. She's in labor! Breathe, Barbie. Somebody call an ambulance. Breathe in. Breathe out. <sighs> Time to get to work. We'll help Barbie give birth. Dr. Carol, are you ready? Yes, Dr. Amanda. Let's get started. Stay strong, dear. You'll be fine. You're going to make it. We'll have to do the surgery. I can see the baby's head. I'm born. Wait, I'll cut the umbilical cord. I don't understand. Why is this Pikachu pink? Did we make some mistake? Uh -huh. Oops, glasses. There you go, a healthy Pokemon. I need to break the news to Ken. Let's make Barbie a doll smartphone. First, we print out little pictures of both sides of the device and carefully cut them out. We take thick paper and glue the screen to it. Then use scissors to get rid of everything unnecessary. On the back side, we apply a nail polish of the desired color. While it dries, we cut out the camera and glue it to the back of our smartphone and decorate it with a Pikachu sticker. At the end, for gloss, we cover everything with clear nail polish. The Barbie doll smartphone is ready. We have something for you. Now you can call your loved one and share the wonderful news with him. Finally, we have a replenishment in the family, and it's Pikachu! I am so happy to be a father! While mom is resting, we need to wash the baby, so why not make him a little baby bath? Trimming the bottom of an old shampoo can. Well, where are my wipes? Now we need to wipe down from the inside and get rid of any residual product. We take the black paint and draw a thick line around the edge. Next, we glue a circle to make our mini tub look like a Pokeball. We cut the black tube into four identical pieces. From them, we will make the legs, which we will glue to the tub with hot milk glue. The tub is ready to use. All that's left is to pour warm water and send the big-eared baby off to bathe. Let's make Pikachu a jacuzzi! <laughs> That'll obviously be more fun for him. Looks like he's already clean. I'll wipe him dry. Come with me, sweetie. Now that you're dry, we can put a diaper on you so you don't make a stinky surprise for us later. The baby looks pleased. But it's not baby time anymore. It's bedtime. And here's a comfy doll stroller just for him. Sweet dreams, Pikachu. Barbie, you might want to take your baby for a walk. I'm sure she'll take good care of him. Have a great walk. She's a good mom. Whoa! How did the dollhouse end up in here? But it's perfect for Barbie and her baby. Only it has to be upgraded, as there's some smudge on the wall. You're right. Oh, I know what to do. I have some Pokemon stickers. That's a cool idea. Let's get to it. It makes the room look more interesting and bright. Cool. But we need to add something else for the baby. Like what? Let me think. Hmm. I got inspired and had a plan. We take out the scotch tape that we ran out of and glue the popsicle sticks to it using hot melt adhesive. You'll have to eat lots of ice cream for this. I hope you have your brushes and paints ready. Next, we're going to paint everything bright red. The main thing is to not leave a speck. I hope you haven't hidden the hot glue yet. As when the paint dries, we glue a wide black ribbon on the bottom of the construction so that nothing sticks out. But that's not all. On top of it, you can add any thin bright ribbon of your taste and another one a little higher glued to the sticks. Such colorful details will decorate the thing, which we made especially for the little Pokemon. Ta-da! The playpen for the baby is ready. You can put Pikachu in there to play in. He'll be safe there. Oh no, he's crying. 
Something's not right. Oh, maybe he's hungry. Here's your bottle. I think it worked. In the meantime, we can make a crib. I got everything ready, so let's go. This time we'll need rollers and lots of paint. We'll cover over one bowl with white on the outside and inside. Painting everything thoroughly. And we'll do the same with the second one, only using red paint. I'm sure we'll have the most comfortable homemade crib. How beautiful it turned out. But there's a pillow missing. And we'll solve that problem quickly. We cut a rectangular piece of felt paper. We fold it in half and apply glue to the edges on the inside, horizontally and vertically. Check that everything is glued well. We should have a pocket inside, which we put down. The final step is to glue everything together and gently press down the edges. Voila! With such a soft pillow, Pikachu will sleep very soundly. Especially if you add a warm blanket. The Pokemon bed is ready. Sweet dreams, kiddo. Oh, is that a Pokeball? I wonder what's inside of it. And where is this from? Some useless ball. I'll be laughed at by decent gamers. Goodness, it's an earthquake. Run for your lives. Uh-oh. Looks like this girl is in for a really mind-blowing surprise. I think I got a little sick. Pika! Pika Pika! Pika Pika? Oh, Pikachu came to visit us? Pika Pika! Pika? You're looking for a family. Dad won't allow it. Pika, Pika! Pika! How touching. You can stay. We will become best friends. Pika! M my hairstyle is d done. Pika! Pika, Pika! Phew, it's finally over. Pika, yummy! Nom, 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 nom! Pika! This mess will get me in trouble. I hear the steps. Let's start cleaning right now. And why did I need so many trinkets? Dad will be absolutely furious. Pika, Pika. Pika, boom, voila. Pika. Work your magic. Wow, and the Pokemon knows a lot about housekeeping. Pika. Pika, Pika, Pika. Great job, Pikachu. Pika, Pika. Whoa, I'll protect it like the apple of my eye. Oops. Why is electricity acting out? Some kind of glitch? <laughs> oh, shoo! <laughs> Holy Xbox, bless you. Brought an animal here again. Oh, shoo! <laughs> Me? No way. How could I, Daddy? Didn't you forget about the list of illegals in this house? Oh, shoo! <laughs> All clear, Chief. Nearly got caught because of his allergies. 